Hey guys, uh, I just wanted to do just one app this time. It's a pretty decently uh, nice app, so I think it would uh, take up the full time of the video. So um, it's called Bump Top, and it's basically a new desktop. It's been out for a while for the PC, but it just came out for the Mac, and uh, I'll put in a link in the description for the Mac and the PC. But uh, so here it is. It's basically a 3D physics desktop per se. And you can do a whole bunch of stuff on the PC and on the full version. You can do a lot more stuff. Uh, I didn't quite um, get the full version or I'm on a PC right now. So um, let me just show you some cool things on the desktop just in general. So I can select all of these and then uh, clean them up, make them look nice, or put them in a pile. And then I can look at the pile or do whatever I really want with it. Uh, I can make the icons go bigger or I can shrink it down. I can view everything in the pile. Or, I mean, you can really do anything, and with the full version, you can, like, scroll through the pile and just a whole bunch of little features, which uh, will be on their website. Uh, if I ever get the full version, I'll make a video of uh, cool features that you can do in the full version and whatnot. Uh, I'll show off some uh, things that I did with mine. Um, some people, you can see some really cool screenshots of them making them all blend together. I just wanted to create four or five different desktops. So, of course, I have my desktop desktop, which is just where I put uh, save stuff and find folders and stuff like that and then over here I have my programming where I have Eclipse and Coda and Interface Builder and Xcode and TextMate and stuff like that and a project I'm working on stuff like that so you can uh, it's really cool and so that's that's what I'll do if I, I'm programming or anything like that Then I have my social one which is a lot I have my media I have my just finance stuff and mail and then I have task manager stuff and uh, stocks and you know pictures and random stuff uh, and I can just open up any of them if I wanted to and it'll pop up and so it's like a real desktop it's not like pictures of uh, what's on there so it works and stuff like that everything's taking a little bit to load and here I have my games I don't have too many games on my uh, Mac side it's more on my PC side and you can still see my desktops on there so it does a really nice 3D job and then over here I have my media spot there's a Tweety uh, I have uh, my photos everything I do with photos I put over here I can uh, make this one smaller and I just made it bigger because I use it the most often and then uh, I can also I have my uh, QuickTime iMovie just my Apple stuff and then I have more of Adobe and uh, movie editor stuff over here so it's just really cool um, of how you can use it um, and the physics are really cool you can do a lot of things with it. The PC one seems to be the best and um, it runs at $30 which um, isn't that bad of a price. Uh, it seems to be pretty reasonable for how awesome it is. Uh, their main thing is like uh, the desktops have been 2D for like 30 or something like that so they have a quite a, a nice place. The physics are cool. It's even a game in itself. I just spent maybe 20-30 uh, minutes just setting up my desktop in itself. I, what I do to get all my apps on the desktop is I'll just like go to the applications folder, let it load for a little bit, and then uh, I'll find this one that I want and I'll make an atlas of it, rename it so it doesn't say atlas because I think it looks bad, and then I can just drag it onto the desktop, and then you have, of course, little arrows on it, but then you don't have to take the application out of uh, the applications folder. You can just keep it in there and then just have it go towards the applications folder. So uh, it's really cool. If you guys have any questions, how to use it, or any cool features, uh, I'll try to make a PC um, video and maybe I'll put it in this one or make a, a part two video, uh, depending how long or how big the video comes out. So I hope you guys like it. It's really cool. Um, they have a whole bunch of cool little neat things where you can write notes like, hey, and then put the note here. Or like, um, make sure to finish programming. I mean, like, you can just put it anywhere, put it on the wall, bottom. And then you can even add photos. So I can just put a photo up here, make it bigger, and then just have it right here. And then I can double click it and open it and stuff like that. So it, it works really nice, and it works really smoothly, surprisingly. And you don't need that fast of a computer to run it. 
Um, one guy claimed to use this 0.7 of their CPU, so it, it doesn't really lag your computer much. It's just a 3D desktop, and it runs seamlessly with everything else, and it works on Snow Leopard, Leopard, and, of course, Windows XP, Windows Vista, and Windows 7. So uh, this is the Mac one, and I'll try and get one out for the PC. Uh, if uh, there's also preferences, which is really cool. Uh, if you guys haven't, if you guys already have it and you just want to look at some cool things, um, this is where you can register your pro version. Sorry, my computer's getting a little slow. And uh, you can change the wallpaper for your back, front, side, and whatever. Uh, you can make it for all of them. You can make it just for the one you choose. And there's also um, start on login and lasso and stuff like that so you can really customize it as much as you want even though it's already customizable and uh... it's really uh... nice um, it's just, like amazing i was just completely blown away when i first saw it uh... i was just looking on some websites and there it was so uh... make sure to keep your eyes out on cool applications if you want me to do a video on uh... more of this or on a different application that you don't understand or you just want me to review um, i'll do that and uh... I'll try and make the PC one. Alright, see you guys.